is Tyson Fury, has he got the reflexes of Muhammad Ali? Because I saw a lot of those... What's going on, people? Hey, welcome to Undefeated. The only... Only podcast with two undefeated fighters. We need to up. still get into... You know that KSI and True Geordie has oh, responded, you know? Oh, listen. It's been time. Listen, have you seen that? We should start like a KSI and True Geordie countdown for how many days it's been since they ain't responded. Yeah, 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 yeah. But yeah. also, you see the beef between KSI and Deji? Bruv. <laughs> listen. Bruv. Do you know, Bruv. so... All right, so in, in, in YouTube, obviously we're allowed to talk about these guys because they're boxers. Why not, bro? One, they, they both have they they, they, they they boxing careers. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, KSI is what? One, one and one? He's two, two and all because he fought No, Logan he didn't win Paul. the second. He didn't win the second Oh, fight. yeah, that's right. Yeah, one win, one draw. Yeah, he's one and one. Mm. Yeah. Deji's um, zero and one. Deji got spun out. Yeah, that's... <laughs> yeah. Got spun so, out. Poor guy. <laughs> Little fella. Um... The, so I'm seeing it. First of all, I see a video of him just, just crying. <laughs> you see it? You see it? Do you know the problem with YouTube, yeah? Mm. Is that's why you got to stay away from YouTube because it's not for everybody. It's not for everyone. Sometimes bro. becoming rich and famous, yeah, can ruin a relationship, bro. It's a lot of stuff. Can you imagine? I might be doing Nostradamus right now. Bro, what if one day you're in a video crying about me? I'll be Fam, so disappointed. I can categorically say yeah. that is not going to happen. <laughs> Wait, wait. But if it does, that, this little point is going to be recorded and <laughs> tweeted to me like a thousand times. What have me me? sitting on big primetime TV talking what about, me? just hurt my feelings <laughs> over and over again. <laughs> Bro, wait, is it toxic that we're laughing at um, the pain that two brothers If it is, it's, Cause still, it's funny to us. So I just want to get it cracking. I'm, I'm still happy to roll with the jokes. I don't know, man. I feel no, I, I, you know what? I gotta be honest. Cause I tweeted about this, so it's there on my timeline. When I saw the video, I laughed all the way through it, and it's like I got to the end and I was thinking, "Right, I probably shouldn't. I probably should feel bad about, but I don't. I it's don't hard feel for bad. me to laugh because they're they're Nigerian, and I feel like a, a sense of a connection. Are you with me? No. Even though you want to bang him in his face, and I'm I'm here for you when you bang him. Listen, in his face. Listen, Deji, yeah, your brother violated the thing in it. If you want me to come and bang up your bro, just let me know. Let mate. man know. I'm on it. Tell him to send us a couple of subscribers to that. Fam, I've been I've been Deji. Listen. Send us a couple of subscribers. KSI will bang up your brother for you. Wait, that's Say not up. that's not KSI will bang up your brother. No, that, that no, sorry, sense. sorry, sorry. I just wanted the subscribers, bro. <laughs> Listen, <laughs> Deji. If you want Travis to handle your brother, I'll give him that good work. I'll yeah? take care of it, bro. He will take care of it. Send man a message, say, get it on. Yeah? And, put, and put like the, the video of me knocking out that Don as well in the highlights, just so it's not just... Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. Put there, that in there. Put there, that in there. there but yeah, are we got out of the way? No, no, but because I find it funny because he's talking about some girl that he liked and yeah. like he, apparently his brother knew that he liked her yeah. and he was chatting to her. But what, these times KSI was already smashing. Wait, so... <laughs> Wait, so since we're here, it sounds like we're stepping down honesty lane now. <laughs> nah, this is their Have honesty you ever, lane. No, but I'm saying now, because we're here, innit? All right. Have you ever done some, like, because we caught, was that dirty macking, when you try to move to someone's thing that's not your thing, but you approach it in a bad way, like? Mm. Be honest, bro. All right. So I'll follow that girl one time, yeah? <laughs> No, but this is this is this is early honesty. Yeah, lane, no, this girl. ain't even an honesty really lane. This like is this. just a dipping my toe in the pool. So I'll let this go. Yeah, mm. she said she had a man mm -hmm. after she's given me a number. We've been speaking for a while. Okay. So at that point, I'm now thinking clearly you're not really respecting my man. Mm. So that means I shouldn't really have respect for my man. So it's like okay. you know when you're you're already in the situation. I'm just like cool and things. Nature took his course. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I can't relate to none of those stories because hey, that. back in the day, I was just always butters. So um, <laughs> I couldn't. I wasn't success. My strike rate of talking to girls was terrible. Is it? Was, yeah, yeah. I was always, I was the worst at chatting to girls. I know we've, because we're supposed to start in the pod, but we're here. No, but since we're here, since we're here, we're here, we're here. I'm going to share. Can I share a story? Go on and share fruit. Go through. But I've always wanted to be that guy. I don't know if I told this story before, but I'm going to tell it now. It's mad embarrassing. So there's these girls, yeah. 
they were like talking amongst themselves and I thought, oh man, like, and it's always been tough for me to move to girls. I just want to let that be clear, yeah? So I thought, sugar, like, how do I impress these girls when I'm on a bike? Do you know what I mean? <laughs> Chill out. <laughs> Chill out. It's the visual <laughs> no, no, of you no. running up on a bike. <laughs> right, it was a racer bike as well. That's what's mad. It was a racer. Or some deep It was a thing. racer. It was a racer bike. You uh, know the ones with the thingies, yeah? With the drop down <laughs> the thingies. So mm. I was like, how can I impress these girls with this, with, like, with this bike? So I thought, you know, boom. Fuck it, I'm going to do a skid. <laughs> I'm going to get close. I'm going to go, shh. How old are you, fam? It's a good age still. <laughs> That's a grown man. That's a good age. That's a good age. I was, good age. I was definitely in secondary school. Yeah, but I thought this is gonna be sick. I'm gonna skid in front of them like yo. <laughs> so I'm riding my bike, like riding yeah. it. Obviously, I want to do a good entry in it. Yeah, <laughs> and I press the brake, but man's pressed the front one. <laughs> I go over. You go over the bars. <laughs> <laughs> I hit the floor hard. Mm. <laughs> For fuck's sake, fam. I had to be hurt. To be hurt. They told me. Did they help you? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I can't do nothing. I can't do nothing. Wait, 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 wait. I was like, I can't, I can't. I'm so on the floor. It wasn't hurting hurt that much, yeah. But I thought I could stay. <laughs> you got to yeah, make it I the go worst of this. I can't go <laughs> Yo, I didn't get that. <laughs> Walking my bike, bro. Yeah, I didn't get. I didn't get numbers. Of course, that. but I, I, yeah, yeah. That's me. That's me talking to girls back in the day. Salute to so you. So you gotta rate me now, because obviously that would never happen now. That's funny. Bro. But uh, yeah, that's me. But anyway, welcome to our defeat. Yeah, man. Yeah, yeah. We're here, we're here, we're here. <laughs> Sorry, that took a mad yeah, like. Mad. We ain't mad. done honestly late in a long time, but yeah. Listen, welcome to undefeated. For all the people that like was in the comment section for mm. the AJ for the AJ one, yeah, man, the last episode got so we much rate you. love for real. We rate you, like, like, round of applause seriously, to you guys, round of applause man. to you lot. Um, I just want to I just want to talk about a dickhead quickly. That, get, um, yeah, get correct. So someone, Jason Peters. Yeah, let me say his name properly. So we, the, wow, that's the, a lot of numbers the in Twitter. His, at, Twitter at. Is, but Jason Peters knows who he is. Yeah, he he added us from Cincinnati, Ohio. You know, he's from Cincinnati. Anyway, Jason was like. Um, because we said that AJ lost because they didn't play Sweet Caroline. Mm. Yeah. And because he was there and he sent a video saying, no, they definitely did play it. Um, and here's the... And what do you say in the... Con- what do you say? Um, he just said, didn't play it, did they? Yeah. And there's the footage. So I just want to say to Jason, you're still a dickhead, even though like I rate what you did there, but you're wrong because they played it, but they didn't play it when it's meant to be played for AJ. Oh, no, nah, come on, man. We've got to give it up, man. They, they, Why? That's what they always do. They play it and then they announce and then he comes out. They don't play it as, it's not his entrance music. He, you know, he, he stopped nah. the tune. I'm telling you. Dude, we have to accept we were wrong. No. Yes, bro. Like, look, look. Every fight, they play it. The crowd gets into a nice vibe. Then they introduce mm-hmm. Anthony. You know what I mean? They they get into that bag. Like, but they hasn't don't. he know? Because what out. I remember is he plays the song. Fam. Then midway into walking to the ring, no. he changes it. No. Yeah, maybe you're right. I'm right, bro. And so's Jason Peters. Fun Jason Peters, man. <laughs> <laughs> Jason, man, you got a lot of Thing is, yeah, a couple, ma- like one other done said, yeah, they d- they definitely played it from what I remember. But when he sent the video, you can't argue. Nothing it? to say, yeah, yeah, boy. Yeah, yeah, he had receipts. Yeah, you know what? Can we be? Is he a great? Div- nah, he's Jason, not. He's not. He's not. Jason, man. And then someone else backed us, and they were just like, nah, it's not that they didn't play. It. It's just that AJ didn't join in with the ba ba ba. That's why he didn't feel right. Ah, uh, this is what so. I'm saying. Yeah, yeah. We got yeah. all things boxing. Yeah. But wicked. yeah, nah, the last episode got a mad love, man. Big up to everyone in the comments. Uh, Tyrius Rose, Andrew Slim, Jay Hard Work, Daryl McKay, uh, Mac, Tender, a few others, but... All you lot are great defeat. Yeah, everybody, We love man. you lot and that. And keep on, keep on talking. And I like to see them arguments in the comment section, you know. So if you lot... If there's something we say that you don't agree with, yeah, let's talk about it. Like, Dion Drummer jumped... Because obviously we said that, you know, we said that we what Andy Ruiz. Ruiz looked like. A Teletubby, Marshmallow... Michelin man, and it was, it was a bit disrespectful. Yeah, 
I wouldn't say it's a yeah, yeah. cool. We've got to let the jokes fly. So then Dion Juma says, I disagree, guys. In combat sports, a lot of the heavier fellas look like that, whether it be boxing, MMA, K1. Believe it or not, that is a type of fighting body that kind of that kind of body has many successes. And you know what's funny? Because you was like, give us some names. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> and then he, he came back. He did. So then he said, George Foreman, Ray Mercer, Fedor, Emilianenko, and Roy Nelson. Fam, George Foreman was only fat because he was like 40-something when he decided to come back. But yeah, the other ones are kind of fat still. But but being but being and Ruiz is kind of kind of the same. He is no, though. He's the that, that, no, no, Ruiz is not. Ruiz, Ruiz and Barbie, is a whole new animal, bro. Oh, Ruiz. get Come out on. of here, man. Ruiz, Ruiz, Ruiz and Barbie. There's no, look the there's same. no, 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 no. Okay. We're not gonna. We're let's, not, yeah, let's, well, let's let's not do that. We're yeah, not gonna. Yeah, that was we're not last last episode. We're here for something new. All right. So yeah. big things that happened this this weekend. Tyson Fury. Can we just stick to? Can we stick to AJ? First? All right. All right. Cool. Let's, let's stick to AJ right, cool, because cool. I've been I've been upset. Can I? I've been upset. Talk to me. Um. You know, you asked me who wins the rematch. Mm. That was your thing. You said, who wins the rematch? And I said, it all depends on what AJ does from this moment. Yeah. And I don't know if I sound like a hater or something, but I, d- I haven't liked what I've been seeing. And I, I understand he has obligations, but I seen him bank p- popping wheelies. I seen him popping wheelies. Bro. I see him. Um, what's the other thing that he's done? Picks with Obama, fam. No, but that's. Again, that's an obligation. I think he had to sit with Obama. And you, if you if you're gonna even if you got banged mm-hmm. and Obama says, Can you do the Obama? You, you like, still show up. You still you show have up. to show up for Obama. Yeah, right? yeah, yeah, yeah. But then it's the other stuff. He's like, I seen a picture of him just chilling with Bear Gal. Like, I don't know if that's new, yeah, but I seen that picture and I was just like, There's no way to I that. hope that's not new. But then again, that could just be a picture with fans, isn't it? They could just want a picture of AJ. No, but if if you get knocked out, if if what happened to him, like happened to anyone I know, I expect that person to go and lock themselves away. Like you should be in the dark, like somewhere, not enjoying. Do you know Does what? that make sense? I'm gonna lie, yeah, yeah. Or am I, I seeing was, it wrong? I was feeling like that, but then I, I disagree now because go ahead. I feel like he could slip into a depression if he does that. No, Remember, like he... he was the champ sitting on top of the hill, just got knocked out by a fat you. Everyone's chatting reckless now. Put some respect on his name, Ruiz. He got knocked out by Ruiz. He's still a fat dog. Okay, cool. Say so not. Yeah. So now everyone's chatting reckless. Everyone feels like they can say what they want about AJ. I saw Andre Ward sitting on a sports show talking about, you know, someone said to him, "You were there was rumors that you was going to go to the heavyweight division, right? How would that have looked?" And he went, as if to as if to insinuate that, oh, I would have done the same. Big man. <laughs> That got me so mad because I was like, Andre Ward, you're good, you. He's like, great. You're top, yeah, top, great, top, great. Hall of Fame without great, doubts. Great, But you're not just going to climb up from light heavyweight yeah. and wrestle with AJ and get the job done. But that's how everyone's feeling. That's how you feel now. That's how everyone's feeling. So I'm saying if AJ stays in that place of, no, I'm going to get it right. Fam, it's easy to just tip the scales and go too far with that mindset. So okay. I feel like AJ is, because however this, is, however this goes, I feel like AJ should have taken a month holiday. I just don't know if it should be like public, but then he's the world famous guy. He's not going to be easy to do something. I secret. feel like he should just be in Ipswich somewhere. Nah, fam. Chilling. Not, why? Chilling but, with, but with that? Marge and Sundarine and like, and all the... Remember, yeah. He needs to be chill. Bro, I don't think he needs to be outdoors. A training, I'm saying? a training camp can only be so long. Otherwise, it's overkill. So he can't, st- he can't stay in the gym from now to November, fam. So when should you get back in the gym? Get in the gym from like, I don't know, end of August, September, October, no, November. No, man, I'm telling you, I'm, I'm, I'm talking Three and about, a half months. he needs to be on a bed, you know what I mean? Like, what, what, he needs this, to be on a single what, bed. This, listening to Nas or Davey. Single bed, <laughs> yeah. Nah, fam. He needs to be on a single bed, one sheet, yeah. <laughs> Bro, I'm talking what, about prison. <laughs> <laughs> He's in a single bed, one sheet, um, a picture of Ruiz, fam. That's it. Nah, bro. Nah, you see that that type of solitary confinement is not actually healthy, fam. It you is. know how easy it is for a fighter to slip off mentally once they take that first loss. Prince Nassim, yeah, when he lost his first fight, he was never the same afterwards. He came back and fought a bum, and then he retired because once he lost, he just he just never came back from it. So he needs to be careful with how he handles his so mental. So you're state. saying you're happy with what is I'm happening? Not, I'm now. not saying I'm happy. I'm just saying I'm not unhappy with it. 
Like, if he takes it too hard, yeah. it can affect him and he got overkill and go too hard, come into the fight fatigued because he trained too hard. Okay. Do you see what cool. I'm saying? He cool. needs to, I think it's good that he has a perspective where he's like, yo, it's bigger, life is bigger than boxing. But at the same time, that's what you say at the end of your career. That's what you say at the end of your career. You can't say that. You can't say that. say, at the same time, there needs to be a balance for when you decide that you're going to knuckle down and level up on your on your boxing skills. Okay. But at the same time, don't tip the scales and go too far and be that over intense you that don't deliver. I don't want to see my man even get a trim no more. I'm, I'm yeah, I want, I want, I want I'm getting AJ. deep. I want it like no trim, but mad focused. Like, do you know what I'm saying? Like, you know when you've just been rocking the same jeans for too long, fam? Yeah, yeah, That's yeah. That's what I want. No post. Yeah, the shiny bit on the front of the legs. <laughs> Bruv. Like, I need... This is what I'm saying. You know when it's rubbed out in the middle, so you got the hole? I don't think it'll happen with Under Armour, but... You know, you're rocking the same <laughs> jeans for so long, fam. Thing is, yeah, what, what, the, the only scary part of all of this yeah. is that... He, so he was at the, C, the CEO summit with Obama. Yeah. The only scary part is now it's looking like his heart ain't in boxing no more. His heart is in business. This is what I'm saying. You just get knocked out and it's like, yo, Obama's here, but I'm still the man, clearly. Yeah. It's like, mm, that lets me know that you're not going to go to the well in the See, same way. Saying, this is what I'm saying. No, so no, you're no, saying no, what I'm, I'm saying. I'm just saying there's two oh, sides. Oh, you're saying there's two sides yeah, to it. Yeah, yeah, and yeah, I, yeah. You know, I respect the other side, but I'm like, you know, I I just want the eye of the tiger back. Mm. That's what I'm saying. And it's, 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 it's so simple. I, AJ beats Ruiz if he's focused. Locked in because that fight's not easy. People are thinking that was a mistake. No, no, it what wasn't. Happened? It wasn't. It that was a, wasn't it was a mistake, a bro. It was a I'm down. telling that guy knows what he's doing. He's a technician. So, you see what I'm saying? So mm. really and truly, the AJ that we see next has to be serious. Like we we watched the um. I don't know if you saw the interview with Eddie Hearn. Yeah, right? yeah, yeah. Great interview, but it, it delivers a lot. So the they, they ask him about. So what happened between you and AJ's dad? And the response was. He gave his everyone. He was cussing everyone. Then it kind of let me know a bit more about the training camp because even in him saying that, trying almost in a deflection way, it kind of showed he said he cussed um, someone about where they were staying. He cussed someone about the food. He was talking about the nutrition. So you start to say, wait, what happened? Remember we said about the luxuries yeah. and everything was getting too on top. It's too, it was too much of a change from Sheffield in that two-bed flat. There you go. But then... See, I'm saying he's sitting with Meek, he was doing all these great, like, but then you go back and you think to yourself, but he never cleared up because he said that it was nonsense about he never said, the no, panic attack. No one ever says what AJ's dad was mad about. This is it. This is, he said he, no, but he tried to say it was the preparation. Oh, what he's saying oh, he is tried to say he it was, was the preparation. upset about the preparation, but why was he upset with Eddie Hearn? What was it that Eddie Hearn did? Hmm. Which is always going to be a mystery. Porter, what you lot think? It'll be interesting to read what you lot think. Mm. Like, right in the in the comments, I know what we think. You see what I'm saying? You know, it's interesting. Like, Ruiz's trainer said that AJ shouldn't take the rematch straight away. Ah, oh, he's trying to hold on to that. Now, belt, it's, that's one way of looking at it. But he could also be looking at it like, the way you lost, you don't need to jump straight back in. And a few people have said that. And the more I think about it, the more Would I look at it. you respect AJ I'll, if he doesn't take the rematch straight away? It's not, well, it's, it's happening it's anyway. Not, yeah, it's not about respect. It's just a case of you got to be smart now because you lose again. I don't know how it looks for AJ going forward. Because well, cause, I, cause what, cause what, let's, let's say mm-hmm. he loses again, right? Yeah. Ruiz goes on to defend the belt and he defend it again. That means AJ now has to avoid Ruiz. No. Yeah. If you beat, well, me, you beat me twice, you're right? He has to avoid him if he has a chance. If he wants to get back to world heavyweight boxing, as in, I need to go find another route. No, but yeah, he can't even go down. That's what I'm saying. What's <laughs> no, I'm late. I'm late. I'm late. So what? what no, but what he can do is because Eddie Hearn almost he didn't say we're gonna lose, but he said that even if he does lose, he's only had 24 fights. I'm trying yeah, to you know, it's the narrative has now gone back to he's still new, he's still a baby. I heard Johnny Nelson saying similar things. Yeah, and I'm like, no, we're not gonna do that. Not at the world level. No. So right now he's saying he in the end he's only lost to one man though. Mm. Do you know what I mean? This, mm. So there's there. I get, I get the net. I get what everyone's trying to say. I think he can. I See, think he can still recover, even if he lo- nah. even if he loses. I think he still can recover. But like, so I went back and I Young watched. Man. I went back and watched um, Lennox Lewis versus David Tua. Yeah. Right. And stylistically, it's very similar to Adrian Ruiz. Yeah. David Tua is more of a compact, small fighter, and anytime they mix it up, yeah, Tua was getting a bit of the exchanges. Yeah. 
And I saw the shift in the chain. I mean, this is the beauty of having a great trainer. Emmanuel yeah. Stewart was in Lennox Lewis's corner. Yep. Legendary. Rest in peace. Amazing. Now, straight away, Lennox Lewis's game plan changed. Keeps him on the outside. Doesn't ever decide to mix it up. Very patient. Keeping him on the outside. And whenever the right hand presented itself, bang. But if it didn't, don't force it. Stay on mm -hmm. the jab. And that fight, I mean, go back and watch it, people. But you Lennox see what I'm can saying? can move better than AJ, though. He can. But that is the game plan that AJ needs to beat Ruiz. Because I don't see him going into the second fight suddenly able to mix up with him. The hand speed was just too much. It's just different. You cannot just get speed in six yeah, months. Yeah, and that guy, yeah. Do you see what I'm saying? Yeah. So the game plan has to be keep him completely out of this fight. You know what I'm saying? Like it's Since you talk about Lennox, though, it's a nice person to bring up. I like Lennox, man. Is Lennox an AJ hater? I don't think he is. I really don't think really? he is. Do you know what? Yeah, here's wait, why wait, I say this. Here's why I say on. this, right? Because you see how when like we hear stuff that older com comedians say about the comedians of today. Yeah. Or whenever something new happens. Shit. <laughs> Do you know where... <laughs> you ain't had it hard. Do you know where that, that comes from? It's the fact that you men are supposed to have taken what we did and taken it to the next level. Yeah. So when you see someone come after you and they're not, they're, they're just about managing, but then you're seeing how successful they are mm -hmm. as a result of this, in your eyes, mediocre level. Yeah. That's frustrating. So then now, you're a hater. That's no, why I'm saying Lennox no, is a hater then. No, it doesn't mean you're a hater. Because yeah. if you want him to do well, but he's not, that don't make you a hater. No. That means you're, 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 you're criticizing. Can yeah. I see it from, can I show you another perspective go of this it, thing? Yeah? And tell, tell me if I'm wrong. I don't think I'm wrong though. Yeah, mm -hmm. That's mad to say that already. That's mad. Back. Tell me if you think I'm wrong, but I don't think I'm wrong. <laughs> so go listen, through. Lennox Lewis yeah, is supposed to be our champion. Not he's supposed great. to be. He's absolutely there. There you go. Very good. Len Undisputed. Exactly. I understand now. Beat everyone that beat him. There you go. So Lennox Lewis is supposed to be our champion. Like we don't, there's so much um, lack of success in Great Britain, like football and all these other things. Yeah. We had one man that was holding it down successfully. Did the nation take him as their, as their darling? I mean the nation. Not really. AJ's coming now. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Girls, man them, pub man them. Sponsorships, yeah. sponsors, Lucas Aid, Hugo Boss, and GQ, and yeah. Obama. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, the world, even after a loss, he's next to Obama. Lennox Lewis, yeah, you don't know how many, how many nighttime runs he did. You don't know that guy put in whack, yeah, yeah, yeah. undisputed, fam. Who cares? No, it's not okay. I'm not, not saying about. I'm saying I like hear what that. You're saying. I hear what I'm you're saying. I'm saying he's watching this young guy mm -hmm. come in the game and just take all the money, everything. At home, he's thinking to himself, "I was better than that guy, and that should have been me." No, nah, it's not that. I, I, I'm really. Not, I'm not rolling with that. that no. Run his head at least once. I has to. Because he's human. I'm not, yeah, but I'm not rolling. Thank with, you very much. So I'm, I'm right. I'm not rolling with that being the narrative for why he speaks on what AJ's doing, though. Fam, if I am a better boxer, yeah, and I've got advice to give you, because remember, he's not just saying, ah, he's not good enough. I he's, got banged. he's saying what he should be doing. See, I got banged in the face, and now Obama's my friend. Nah, cuz, <laughs> nah, that Dude, don't mean that. Who was in office when, what you call it, was, he ain't got no pictures of John Major, fam. He <laughs> 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 he ain't got no pictures with him. What, like Tony Blair? Tony Blair? He ain't got those pics. He ain't got those photos. That said John Major, you know. I took it back. That is so funny. <laughs> I, took <it> back. <laughs> I took it back. Are you mad? I'm telling you. No, but you know what? I generally don't think he's, he's just hating for the sake of hating. Things he's saying, is, Bro, they're legit. Bro, he said, look, I tried to... When nah, he said, when he talk about it, he came man. out to the wrong song. Remember when he said it's he tried a, to show his... And that's exactly room. what we said. So if that's what we're saying, what, we hating as well? No, but we're not boxers. Nah, bro. I'm sorry, bro. Everything he said was legit. He even posted a video of him walking to the ring to fight Tyson. Did you see his eyes? <laughs> he, would, he would have killed anyone, bro. <laughs> bro, to fight Tyson, man went in there with energy. And he's saying the ring walk is important and the caption walk. It makes perfect sense. I think so, he's hating. Nah, you can say he's hating, but the advice is legit. I hear if the, the advice didn't no, make sense, I'm then it's hating. Bro, as I said, like... If someone, how he won. He's now look saying at, bro, he needs to I'm get I'm going to bring something back to you now. Fam. Look, this is what, this is, let look at the psychology. Right. No, let me, let me just get no, this out first. I'm, let no, me get no, this out no. first, please. Right, go to you, go and land. He, um, obviously, he responded to the, the AJ fight, right? Yep. He says, I think he needs to look at changing the trainers. Mm -hmm. They were saying, why does he need to change trainers? He goes, you can't expect to graduate from uni with your nursery teacher. 
That's legit advice. Everybody is saying that Rob McCracken is under the lens right now. You can't expect to graduate from uni with, with your nursery, nursery teacher. teacher. That's kind of hard oh. still. It's a bar. <laughs> Different bar. No, That's not a man know, who is know, just hating. Do you know what That's kind legit. of hating I'm doing to bring up that level of philosophy, fam? No, but it's fantastic. Do you know where I have to be? I have to be in my house thinking, He's how like, can I say this, cuz, to understand? <laughs> he's sitting at home. Bro, I'm telling you, he look at this. He brought out the book of facts. He brought out, <laughs> bro, he's like, how do I say this? So now let me bring this back to you, yeah? In the UK, I say we haven't had a lot of success. In Great Britain, we haven't had a lot of success. So when a man it just almost wants to be, look at Tin Henman, fam. They gave him a Kellogg's cereal, fam. Sustain. Fam, you remember that? Right. Where's Lennox Lewis's cereal, nah, nah, fam? Nah. Let's let's look at Lennox Lewis's sponsorship. Where's bro. his thing, fam? Nah, because Lennox Lewis ain't no bum, fam. We're sponsored by Lonsdale, fam. Just <laughs> just Sports Direct, fam. It's a different. Go on. It's uh, a different thing. It's a different thing, fam. I don't even know. I don't even know. You can't even find it. Fam, listen. This <laughs> he stuff ain't is, got no cereal, This stuff is fam. not relevant, fam. Bro, I'm We're talking you, about boxing. Forget all that, all that all other stuff. This, they, so you don't want the luxuries. No, but listen oh, to wait, what I'm saying. Yeah, um, FC UK. FC UK, that's right. Yeah, that's well, right. Well, no that? guy test. <laughs> Preston, listen. Bro, got a man Lewis wasn't no, that, man. Lewis like, no small boy, man. Like, please understand that, bro. The guy, and when he talks about the fact that he doesn't, he doesn't fight the proper fights. He's a man that's done it, so that's why he's saying you got to do all of that. I fought Holyfield. I fought this man. I went to fight Riddick Bowl. Riddick Bowl vacated the title. I fought Tyson. I fought Galat. We're gonna get to that. We're gonna get that because they, they they're saying that. Well, all right, that's for the classic effort. Let's keep it moving. But I'm saying, but I'm saying, saying is, but Lennox you look Lewis at, is hating. But no, no, no. He's, he's hating. hating. We don't have but to agree. But look at his resume, bro. I understand. He and beat that's why everyone he's he faced. I'm with you. That's why he's hating because Ruckman he's hit him with a lucky shot, came back and sparked out Ruckman, fam. Can you he imagine? got the job done. Look at this. His whole career was Just amazing. Just imagine, yeah. Beat Vitaly Klitschko. Who is the better Klitschko? Bro, Lewis is not hating. Okay, so hear this now. Just imagine, yeah, that you went to uni, yeah? You, you studied hard, paid for everything. Like, you grinded, yeah? You got bag of debt and the next man went to uni for free. How do you feel? Yeah, I'm looking at man in, in a exactly. funny way. That's how Lennox is feeling, fam. He's nah, but, death, but, fam. but if he's got legit reason and the stuff nah, he's saying he's makes sense. Nah, forget right. hating. Just call it hate, fam. Nah, nah, I'm not just going to call it hate. I'm not jumping on a wagon just to say it's hate. <laughs> if man it. is a dickhead and you say he's a dickhead, he's a dickhead. That's it. Nah, bro. He's hating, fam. Nah, Anyone man. that can say that nursery. Nah, and that's hate, a bar. This hating stuff that's is how people bar. protect their egos. Oh, you just hating. Nah, because you ain't got no jab. Your stamina's dead. You get tired. You need a new trainer. This is legit statements. Nah, bro. Hater. Listen, keep keep shining, bruv. Obama knows his name, fam. That's all I'm saying. After I get banged and I'm with Obama, I've won. Anyway. <laughs> your U-turn. <laughs> your u is nuts, bruv. <laughs> I, I mean, I, no, because you're talking like me, Lewis yeah? ain't no hater. Gee, I saw you today. Before we started this podcast, you was looking at videos of David Hay. Why? Yeah, because oh, that's, that's a legend. That's David Hay. It's a legend. <laughs> If we were for the Achilles injury, he'd have beat Melly, bro. <laughs> Listen, you think you think a prime David Hay couldn't take a, take a, a, take AJ? <laughs> if Ruiz could give him trouble with his small self and that little bit of speed, you think David Hay would struggle? He would you. blast that man away. <laughs> I can't take Talking you. about David Hay was one of the ferocious finishes. Hey, <laughs> no, stop it. <laughs> <laughs> This guy loves. You don't understand how much. Listen, <laughs> you talk bad about David here around me. I, I'm, I'm here for it, bro. When he beat McCormick for the undisputed cruiserweight champ, bro. The only undisputed um, cruiserweight champ in the world is Holyfield. David Hay and Evander Holyfield. That's great company to be a part of. And they beat Nikola Valuev. <laughs> Nikola Valuev was eight stone heavier than David Hay. Wait, stop, stop. I hate you. Don't let me get right. my bag, bro. Cool, let's be one that. <laughs> Lennox is a hater, but Travis doesn't agree why it is what it is. Nah, Let's see what, a... You lot, settle it. Tell is us. Lennox Lewis a hater? Tell us in the, Let tell us, us hater, but cool. Let's anyway, keep it moving. You see how Lennox Lewis banged up Shannon Briggs? <laughs> Go watch that again. That's how you overcome adversity. <laughs> anyway. And that's it. That was a scrap. All right, that's so um, Tyson uh, Fury. Sugar, there we go. Tyson Fury fought this weekend. And against... Tyson, Tyson Fury is the best heavyweight in the whole wide world. Well, yeah, because he beat well-known um, Tom Schwartz. Yeah. I sound, we sound like haters. It would have been a more high-profile fight if he fought Tom Ford. 
<laughs> no, wait, wait, wait. Let's not be. Wait, stop, 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 stop. What? Because I feel like the hate is kicked in. Why is it fine. hate? No, but I'm why saying... is it hate? I hate the stuff where everything's hate because it's negative. <laughs> Bro, the guy's ranked at fifty-seven. Mm. You mean there was fifty men that could have gone ahead of this you, but you went that far down the list to, to do what? Guarantee a knockout. I'm yeah, supposed to be a, excited. It was. A, it was. A, it was he had no respect because he came out with the Apollo Creed. Like, he Bro. came out with this Rocky vibe. Like, you, he like didn't he's... take him seriously at all. It was this, when it, he was, come... it was stupid, bro. It was bad. And then, what, what's, what, honestly, let's be real now. Is, is Tyson Fury, has he got the reflexes of Muhammad Ali? Because I saw a lot of those videos. I'm not going to say Muhammad Ali, but he's got good reflexes. He's I don't think people... Amazing. People are disrespecting Muhammad Ali by even mentioning him in, a, in relation to Tyson Fury. People haven't seen Muhammad Ali recently. That's all it is. Mm. When you don't watch stuff after a while, you have the memories of what it looked like. But it's all slowed down because your memory is, is, plays it slowly in the highlights. But we're watching Tyson Fury thinking, oh, right, yeah. Turn, 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 dip. Yeah, cool. Fam, go and watch Muhammad Ali again. Yeah, 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 yeah. Do you know yeah, what I mean? Yeah, like, yeah. put Muhammad Ali on right now and watch what that looked like when he fought Sonny Liston. Yeah. And Sonny Liston's flicking that jab and man's just literally on the end of it, just turning his head just slightly. Fam, yeah, it's like yeah. Matrix, cuz. Yeah. So yeah. I'm not having Tyson Fury be compared because you fought Tom Schwartz. That's not Sonny Liston. That's if not he, even a dangerous man. But if man. he does that against Deontay Wilder, wait, Deontay Wilder's not Deontay like Wilder his... banged him down twice no, in the top round. We no, saw that. No, but Deontay Wilder, again, is not like a... No, uh, he's not supreme like, yeah, puncher. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's not accurate puncher. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's bro. say if he does that against AJ, that would be very impressive, though. No, it would be impressive. That would be very impressive. But what we're not just going to do is put this this Muhammad Ali talk. Yeah, we're going to... I'm we hearing white that. Muhammad Ali talk, and I'm just like, yo, this is what ruins the whole experience of Tyson Fury, is the fans and how mad they go. Because yeah. if we're going to crucify um, Deontay Wilder for having a padded record, let's just quickly analyse... Tyson Fury's record, right? Ooh, you came with your facts today, yeah? Nah, yeah, because I'm I'm really sick of this Ooh. narrative that this man is that fantastic. All right, so go on, let's go. Let's start at Steve Cunningham. Yeah, Steve Cunningham. Yeah, Joey Abel. Mm-hmm. Derek Chisora. Oh, that's a Good name fight. we recognize. Good fight. Christian Hammer. Yeah, Klitschko. Amazing. This is the pinnacle the of his that career. That was an amazing fight, by the so, way. I've never seen anything like that. So he fails a drug test. Mm-hmm. Yeah. For Nandrolin, yeah. right? Him and his brother both failed a drug test, right? Yeah. Then he goes into a, a depression and goes into other substances. Mm-hmm. But let's not forget that the reason why he came under scrutiny was because he failed a drugs test for steroids, Nandrolone. Anyway, let's move forward. He comes back to fight Sefa Seferi, because we all know who that is, and Francesca Pianetta, another well-known fighter. Boom, Deontay Wilder. Draw. Which no matter how you dice fight. it, no matter how you dice it, he won that fight. No matter how you dice it, he won that fight. See, this is the thing. He won that fight. This is the thing. He won that fight. But this is this is the thing, bro. He won the fight. Tyson Fury fans are doing that. No, he didn't because on box rec, that blue D means draw. But he won so the fight. So you can't decide just because it looked like he won that he won. No, you no, drew. We're gonna get so into Kid after Galahad. the draw, we're gonna get into after, Kid Galahad yeah, and work. Yeah, and yeah. Robbery's happening then... in boxing all the time. Exactly. Nigel That's... Ben, in my view, and most people's view, beat Chris Eubank in the rematch. But it's a draw. Then he fights Tom Schwartz. So how many credible names on there? Deontay Wilder, Klitschko, Klitschko. and Chisora, If you really need to put someone right. that you recognize. Yeah. Three. So that's three nights with credible boxers. And we're talking about Muhammad Ali? Don't. Oh, if we're oh. getting with the Muhammad, Muhammad... Okay, we're getting with the Muhammad Ali Fam. narrative. Fam. Yeah, I hear... I, okay, So I on three nights work, you were the greatest of this era? Don't oh, forget Kevin Johnson. Sh- Kevin Johnson. No, oh, wait, 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 wait. snap. Kevin Johnson. Man like... Man Kevin like Johnson. KJ. <laughs> Kevin Johnson. Sorry, bruv. I look like Kevin Johnson a little bit, you know. It's another Let one. Let me get this picture. It's another one, yeah. <laughs> no, you don't. Respect yourself. No, 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 like Kevin Johnson. I'm telling you, the latest, the recent, the recent, he's got me in that. He's got, nah, I swear gee, to nah. you. Wow. Right, I'm going to show you some stuff. That's but mad. He's, he's like, mad deleted. So we're looking at this record, right? You yeah. see what I'm saying? Yeah. That's a, how, how was this man the greatest? Okay. I think this is, this is my honest opinion. Because AJ's been putting bodies away, you know? No, but I, there's a difference in, it's stylistically, yeah. I do love the way Tyson Fury moves. He doesn't move like anyone. He he's actually like there's no heavyweight boxer 
with his movement skill, with his like his trickery. It's not he's moving like someone that's not the size that he is. Yeah, he's bro. Been, he's he been made he made he made what you call it look. He made few, he made um, Klitschko mm -hmm. look average, bro. Do you know like Klitschko was so confused in that fight. He didn't know how to. I I I that night in Dusseldorf, fam. It was a great night. It was, it was I, bro. Night. I was. Yeah, I, I looked at the fight and I, I was scratching my head. It got to the sixth round and I was like, oh my God. Even Klitschko was looking around thinking, oh my God. Like, why is nothing working? Bro, so, the guy, his movement. And this is, this is all I wish he had, yeah, mm -hmm. was a bit more power. That's all I, like, that's all he needs. Just a, a bit more power to, um, to finish. Because even, I wish he finished, like, this, his fight against Deontay Wilder, I was saying... Look how he, he's making Deontay Wilder look stupid. Do you see what I'm saying? Luckily, Deontay Wilder hit him with that shot when he did mm. in, the, in, the, in that last round. Yeah. Because Deontay Wilder, remember Deontay Wilder's come in with the bird thing, looking, he's doing all of this. This is a guy that's been out for so long, put on a lot of weight. Yeah. Yeah. He's come back and he looks amazing. Amazing. Now, I was listening to what he was saying, and he's because they said, Why you didn't take the Deontay Wilder fight straight away? And he said it was a money thing. He said, Um, the viewers they, they had about 300,000, um, 300,000 people watch the big heavyweight fight, and he says it's not enough. Mm -hmm. He said that that's not enough. He's gone to ESPN to he wants to build up. So, really and truly, Tice, because at first I was a bit upset, I thought it was a bit of a coward's move not taking the fight immediately. Mm -hmm. I thought. Why would you do that? But then I get now, he's putting on a show. As you said, he fought Tom Schwartz. He's, wa he's wearing the clothes. Yeah, he's fighting bumps. He's, like no, he, but like he's, he always has. No, he wants to put and on a show. some people don't like when you say bumps. To get bumps. an entrance. He wants to put on a show for interest. Like, tell me you weren't, I, you're still intrigued by him. What do you mean am I still intrigued by and him? And I'm saying, you, you get more and more intrigued by Tyson Fury by just watching, even though it's nonsense. He's an entertaining man. But he's not an entertaining, he's not like a, a, a dynamite boxer. Like he's gonna do what he always does. And against these level of, this level of opponents, he's gonna look amazing. Mm -hmm. He's gonna have the confidence to stand on the ropes and do all the foolishness that he does because there's no threat there. Tom Schwartz is not a problem. Okay. Do you know what I mean? Like just because you. what happened, Andy Ruiz happened, so now people are thinking, oh no, but he's got a chance. No, not every time. These things are not commonalities in boxing. Yeah. When you are going into the 50s for the rank to look for your opponents, bruv, it's more than likely you're just going to spin this guy out. If yeah. Tyson Fury can look like a, a devastating puncher in that fight, round two, he was peppering this you and the Donnie was just all hurt and backing up. <laughs> bruv, who does Tyson Fury back up and stop against the ropes? Oh, bruv, if you can, f you look long and hard to find this brother you can hurt. Mm. Bro, he was hitting Wilder with straight shots, bang, in the face. Yeah, yeah, Fam, yeah, yeah, nothing's yeah, happened. Donnie yeah. was just walking forward. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I'm not rolling with this Tyson Fury stuff. I'm just looking at it like, listen, you lot are just excited to have a guy to come in and look like a conventional dude. So he's relatable to the, the, the mass audience in a different way than AJ is. Because mm -hmm. AJ... Because you can't get that. We can't win. No one looks like AJ like, right, yeah, he looks like me. But Tyson yeah. Fury's got that thing. But my thing is like, what irks me is the narrative that, yeah, you know, he's battled hard from this and the depression. I'm like, I, you know. I don't rate that. I rate that though. I, I respect that, that as well. Yeah. But we cannot forget that it was a banned substance that you was found in your system, which started this. Do you understand? Mm. He was banned and from boxing. That. I'm not gonna lie, I do forget we that. We do forget that because the narrative is now this, this wonderful story of a man that came back, but bruv, Steroid users are not supposed to be embraced and in, in, uh, looked at as just wonderful people that come back from struggle and adversity. Brother, you cheated. There we go. We're you back think AJ this. could be on steroids and come back because he had a rough time at dealing with that and come back and people were like, there you go, bro. There you go. Do you reckon Lance Armstrong's doing a Lennox Lewis and he's hating on all of these guys? <laughs> <laughs> Lance Armstrong! Lance Armstrong! Lance Armstrong. Like, you look at the steroid the users. <laughs> they got me out of here. He was telling us to live strong. Listen. <laughs> and, then, and then there's rumours that um, Tyson Fury might be fighting Jerome Miller later this year. Never. Oh, it takes one to know one, though. <laughs> Listen. <laughs> exactly. Oh, you was on the good stuff? Oh, nigga, so was I. <laughs> Let's go. No, because I, I watched the interview and Jerome Miller said he didn't cheat. Oh, please. This, this dude <laughs> had an injection. He said, no, he said he didn't go. In the arm, he in the butt that, cheeks. He, no, he, said, he, that, he said that it was wrong. He said that they, um, 
he didn't cheat. He said that what you lot think is not really what happened and because you lot don't really know boxing, that's the line. Yeah, so that's... when you don't know boxing... Fam, he you didn't cheat, though. He's saying, so officially, he didn't fam, cheat and that's why need, he's back. He needs to stop chatting rubbish, bro. Go to IFL, yeah? Them interviews be so in-depth and the people in the comments, they know what the hell's going on. Don't try yeah. and chat to us like we're dumb. <laughs> you was on everything, fam. That was on growth hormone. <laughs> Horses, fam. Horses are on that. <laughs> nah, I'm good, bro. All right, cool. Let's keep it moving, man. Why not? Um, so what, wait, so what do, you, do you, what do you think though? Is, it, is the boxing industry going to take back um, our big baby? Of course they are. Yeah. They talk about Luis Ortiz, talk about Tyson Fury, they talk about Dillian White. Who else is there? Bro, people have been busting for this don't, stuff. Don't put Dillian and people White are, in there, Nah, man. but he got caught on the roids though. No, but the thing I is though, Dillian, no, but the thing is like- I'm so, I'm, this is my problem. Do you know what it is? I'm one of those people that once I'm a fan of you, yeah, I will like try to not look at your blemishes. Like, I just... Like, that, you know what it is? That was me with Floyd Mayweather, right? Yeah. Bro, when he was active in his career, oh, I was a ride or die Floyd fan. This is what but I'm I, saying. And I, I just totally... About Dillian and I totally I disregarded care. the fact that he's a terrible human being outside of the ring. <laughs> <laughs> you could tell me, like, he don't do nothing for no one. I'd be like, listen, that's his money. Why does he have to? <laughs> like, I would listen. <laughs> I'm back in Floyd all day. <laughs> and that's what I thought about Dillian, bro. I, I like... I just like him. But I like how I like how really he is. I like how. No, but he, I like I like dealing with. I well, like man. him like a lot. Like you're, I see him and I'm like, you're the man. You like, know who's growing on me as well? Who? His brother, bro. Oh yeah. When I see baby his brother, but I look at, I think to myself, nah, we need more. It's, we need more Dean White, bro. It's a baby thing, fam. Yeah, we need more What's Dean White. Brilliant, bro. I need more IFL interviews yeah, with yeah, Dean yeah, White. Yeah, I'm yeah, here yeah, for yeah. those. Please, man. Um, all right, let's let's go into what else we got? We got should we? Yeah, Warrington. so Warrington, Kid Galahad. Amazing. Recently. Do you know what? So we said, it's annoying because we said we should do a live. Usually we do yeah. like a, we'll do a live stream of different People are fights. asking for the lives, you know. Yeah, we need we, to, they yeah. need to come. We should have done that for this Josh Warrington, Kid Galahad fight because... Um, it was a good fight, man. It was a great fight. And again, it was, it was. It, I felt like it was almost I, in Mexico and yeah. it felt like a Mexican robbery. I had that for Kid Galahad. Kid yeah. had won that, but uh, like for about one, two rounds for me. Like Josh Warrington was just left wanting so many moments in that fight. Both great fighters, though. Oh, Literally, yeah. I mean, both amazing fighters. Warrington and Frampton, what a fight. That made me a Super. fan. I'll be honest, yeah. Super. I prefer the like the middleweights heavier, and up. The heavier punches. I'm watching, yeah. yeah. When I watch the light guys, I, it, don't, it don't do it for me. Like, Fast and punches, no one gets yeah, knocked out. Yeah, like it's a lot of pushing around. <laughs> yeah. But that fight. That's when I was like, no, I'm following Josh Warrington. Yeah. This fight, Kid Galahad looked like he just had his number, man. And it's just, it is the home advantage, though. Sometimes home yeah. advantage goes such a long way because even it will sway the judges because whenever Warrington was getting crowd busy, go, the crowd goes crazy. Yeah. So that when the judges, and it's hard because I, I, I'm trying to think about being in the eyes of a judge, but if the crowd is getting crazy and it, what I've heard so much, when I'm judging, I'm like, well, the crowd were doing more yep. when he was active. That's gonna sway me mm. in some way. I have to be a really mentally strong person, or so focused into um, into the fight that it doesn't happen. Yeah, Do you know what I mean, that's like I have to take in what these judges. I have to take in what the crowd's doing. It's it's a lot. It's you know? a lot. And like Eddie Hearn said about that fight, he said, "I watched the fight. He goes, Kid Galahad. I think he won it by one or two rounds, but he's not gonna get it. He's he's not done enough to take it from the champion mm. in the home, like from a home crowd decision." And I'm like. I hate the fact that that's a part of boxing. Yeah. Where it's like, you've done enough to win, but yeah. is that enough to take it from the champion? Yeah. I'm thinking, you've beat the man. It should be enough. But with that being said, boxing is, it works the way it works. You see, and what the, the sad thing is, because I want to see a number two. I want to see that fight again. See, but... this is what I didn't like. Straight away after that fight, Josh Warrington was just like, yeah, you know, I'm, I'm looking for world honors. I want to fight for this, for the unifier. I want to, you know, get the other belts. And I was just like, that's an... I mean, you might just want that because he was saying he goes, "It's hard for me to kind of get motivated for just a defense, another defense. I need mm. another." And I, I get that because it's like you know, what I mean, you want to be able to have See, that. He doesn't fire. want a trilogy. He doesn't want to. He is not gonna want to fight that fight again because it's like I got through it. Let's just move on because it's like that was hard for no reason. Kid Galahad is not necessarily a big money name mm -hmm. where it makes sense in that way. So it's just like it's just hard for no reason. Let's just get move on. It is what it is. But listen, big up both fighters. Kid Galahad, like, I'm yeah, a fan. Yeah, yeah. I'll, be, I'll, be, I'll be honest, I'm not a huge fan. Because every I'm time I see him fight, I always feel like, oh, 
can we just get to the main event? Because he's never on. He's never like yeah, yeah, <laughs> the, top yeah, the main girl. thing. But it, it's only a matter of time. Literally, I I'm gonna be watching now. Mm. From now, I'm like, you know, cool. He made a fan of me. I'm not gonna lie to you. So uh, a fighter as well this week tried to break the Drake curse. <laughs> Andrew Tabiti, yeah, took a picture with Drake. Fancied his chances. Is this before the Raptors won Had the NBA championship? Potentially, potentially. But he got knocked the hell out in his fight this week. And I was just like, these men so need to stop playing. <laughs> they need to stop playing. Drake is a demon. Like, all right, look, this, this, this is the... This is the uh, I mean, he did that sound. But like... It's a, it's a, it's a really, it's a really bad knockout as well. <laughs> oh, what the hell? Where is it? Hold on. Oh my God! Look, he's bro. He's, he's frazzled. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. I get it. I get it. Oh, yeah, let me get shit, it. No, 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 no. Okay, there we go. Okay. Late because he just threw a bit of a tied one two door to Cotton. He got countered by a left hook, and that really was the beginning of the end for him. Tenth round, nice yeah. Again, cool to beat these on it. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. They're, they're, they're gaining at each other. You know what I'm saying? Good, like, he's keeping the distance. You know what I'm saying? Land a good right hand there. You know what I'm saying? The victory is in his mind. Do you know what I'm saying? It's tenth round. It's like 34 seconds in the clock. Oh, <laughs> with one of the maddest. One, two combos, bro. Bro, his gum shield looks broken. <laughs> <laughs> and that's rubber. He looks like when he he breaking a, <laughs> Will he break a rubber gum shield? Um, he's, no, he's not, he's not okay. Out. Out cold. Fam, listen. Stop taking pics with Drake. I'm telling the man then. I don't even want to meet him. <laughs> bro, I'm telling I don't want to meet him. I'm the man I'll be dude. happy if I never meet Drake. Bro, I'll just like the music, keep putting that out. Um, don't need to, don't touch me, if, bro. That'll be your last show, you Fam, know. Man, get on stage and all of a, a sudden, nothing for, works. Forget all your jokes, bro. Not even forget them. They just stop being funny. Can There's you, a spell on them. <laughs> you bang them the same way, man. I was like, can you imagine okay. taking a picture of Drake and then coming to undefeated podcast and all the videos are gone? <laughs> what? Zero views, <laughs> fam. This Drake thing is real. Nah, no, I actually... He's a demon. Yeah, because Drake has been doing this, but does it, now because his team, Drake's team, won a championship, is the curse broken? Nah, it's not broken. Just because... It, is it just means but, it's but, only for... But, but did he take picks with the team? Because remember, it's it's, them, it's always them one picks where it's just like... Yeah, he didn't do that. That's he what I'm saying. That. That's when he's so summoning he to do that's that that when with, he's summoning That's when the, the demons. power... <laughs> I don't ever want to... Nah, Drake is not... Nah, bro. <laughs> Pun that you... Like, so you're, saying, you're saying Drake, like... You get a picture of Drake. No, I'm not doing it. Not doing it. I mean, serious. I do not want a picture of Drake. Like, like, I don't want a picture of Drake. I'm happy to meet him. But chat when, when Drake in the room, was giving out money... Go chat Drake. in the room. Oh, yeah. You don't want to take a picture of that Drake? I'll take He's it. like, hey, go, 500 grand. All right. Yeah, because they're like, at least start a hedge fund. Yeah, we have nice. Uh, you know you'll lose all the money. Nice. You know you'll lose all the money. Nah, it's cool. You, you invest in the wrong business. No, you know? <laughs> the Drake curse is real, man. You would just have that Stocks just go to zero overnight. <laughs> Might get that phone call from the broker. It's like, Trav, I'd, I've never seen anything like this before in my life. God's land. Nah, but for real. Nah, I'm good. I'm, I'm not interested in that. Man's in so, some demon business. He all, calls himself six all god. All fighters. I don't know what that is. All fighters. Stay away from Drake. And if AJ tries to do it again, because that's I'm betting we big. I'm it? betting big on Ruiz. <laughs> <laughs> I'm talking like the whole savings account on Ruiz. You think I'm playing? If I see yeah. him take another picture with Drake, the, all the five goals, yeah? yeah, yeah, yeah. Stoppage inside six. <laughs> the whole savings account. The whole savings account. I said all the five goals, but you missed that one. Oh, you think that's what I got? Say? <laughs> no, yeah. that disrespect. <laughs> 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 Okay. I'm in order. <laughs> I'm in the five bills in the same five account. Bills in the it's savings. crazy. And it's treated with respect. <laughs> that's nuts. Well, we're uh, laughing. Some people ain't even got savings. Yeah, no, nah, let's, let's... Try and save though, man. Nah, like, savings stop important. Stop some bonds and that. Like, savings man, important. Try that shit, man. For real. It's very important because we're laughing, but... But there was a madness over the weekend as well. Ma Maris Breedis, yeah? I thought this done. Christoph Glowacki, oh, yeah? Can we just see it again? What type of ref in... Can, right. can we see this again? This is... Cool. This is... This was so just for the people that listen on Spotify and however you listen audio style. 
Um, I'm just going to help you out because you can't see this, but I'm going to explain it for you clearly. So there's an amazing fight, yeah? At a point in this fight, <laughs> a boxer decides, you know what? My arms are not enough. My elbows. I'm just going to elbow this you in his <laughs> mouth. It's what he needs. <laughs> yeah. It's the end of the second round. I, can't, I don't want to say the names wrong, so... Maris Bradis. And he elbows Glowacki, Christoph yep. Glowacki. There you go. So it's getting cracking this now. Is that nuts. And this is it's round the two. cleanest. It's the cleanest elbow, though. Go back, go back, go back, go back, go back, because it's not. They're all tangled up. They're all... Bang. Bam. Elbows him in the mouth. Straight in the mouth. He goes down, he's hurt. But then what happens? Next is just toxic, bro. So the referee takes away a point, you know, as he's supposed to. Fight continues. He's obviously shaken up by that elbow. It's, it's, it's had a lasting effect on him. Yeah. Bang. Big right hand. Goes down again. Goes down. Taking account. Referee's counting him. There's like 10, it's coming up to like 10 seconds left in the round. Yeah. All he's really got to do is survive the round, right? Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Bell goes. They are still fighting. They are still fighting. The bell is going. The referee's clearly letting man get finished. Takes more shots and goes down again. Fam, they fought on for like 10, 10 seconds after the bell had gone. Now, this one looks like he's finished now. Comes out next round. Of course he does. My thing is this. You see how boxers get shot? Like yeah. once they're shot, it's like he's not the same, he's done, he should yeah. retire. I feel like that's, that's happened to this referee. <laughs> he put the fight was the referee. The referee shot. The referee's done. All his instincts, they're out the window. We need to get him out of there. Wait, the referee the referee heard the bell. The referee heard the bell. Wait, so the referee heard the bell and said that's not the real bell. Just kept it going, fam. Kept Do you it reckon going. he was enjoying action? Because referees be enjoying action, you know. Fam. <laughs> All I'm saying is, if I'm fighting here and the bell goes and the referee's looking at me like, <laughs> as I'm getting spun out, no, nah, I'm going mad. I'm seeing it. different refs that enjoy yeah, it. Like they what, like, yeah, the yeah, one with the white eyes. <laughs> Listen, he loves going to work. Yeah, that referee. So did they had they reprimanded that referee? Yeah, it's on. It's, it's there's a lot of speculation about it now. They're gonna do what they're gonna do, but nothing as of right now. But it's disgusting, bro. Yeah, nah, that's not right. You can't. Because the, if the bell goes and you let them still swing, because usually sometimes the, you yeah, know, they're swinging after cook. the fight, yeah, 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 like yeah. Two, two swings two each. Bangs, yeah. Then you're like, no, 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 it's no, like, guys. Back he, to your corners. You know, the one, you know what I like here? You know what? Yeah. The, the bell goes, ding, ding, ding. I hit you. And then man quickly hits back. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And it's like, they look at each that's, other like, I see that, dickhead. And then they walk off. <laughs> oh, that's what I'm like. Next round's yeah, going to be amazing. Be amazing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're not allowed to really. That's let, what I'm saying. You just carried on letting them scuff like, no, leave them. That's what happened with um, AJ and Dillian White. Oh, amazing. Because he I'm hit him after the belt. And he just went right, right over the yeah, ref. Yeah, yeah. Oh, I think the man named jumped in. Is that the same one when the man brother, jumped in? His the brother ring? jumped in, yeah. yeah, yeah. Thing, fam. Oh, it's mad. <laughs> so, um, Kelbrook, there was rumors of Kelbrook retiring. Yeah. But he's, he's come out and he squashed those rumors. And now people are saying, right, does the Amir Khan fight still have any value? Are we seriously waiting for this Amir Khan fight? Fam. No, no, no. Are we seriously you know waiting? You, you know your boy is holding out for his girl to like. Take him back. Yeah. But it's been like three years. Like she's fully pregnant. It's like, brother, yeah, he... exactly. It's just like, leave it alone, fam. That's Bruv. what Kel Brook is looking like. He shows up to all Amir Khan's fights, giving mad interviews. And it's yeah, like, fam, you're bro. getting fat now, bro. Do it, do it. Because that's like P. Diddy still singing about J-Lo, fam. You can't do that. She's fully moved on. Bear marriages. Do you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Take that, take that. Take <laughs> you can't do that. Nah, so you have to understand that Kel Brook needs to say to himself, this fight ain't coming. My, do you know how mad it is? Amir Khan, I swear he's going to go fight a kickboxer or something. He's going to fight, no, nah, he's going to fight some random don in India for the Pearl, the WBC Pearl belt. They just made that belt. No, I'm joking. <laughs> they, they, they literally just made that belt for him in this fight. Is it like an Indian? If, is it a pearl like an Indian? Has it got a connection to India? A pearl or are they taking a piss? I have no idea, fam. But all I know is this. If he wins that belt... Because of the rupees and the... the... <laughs> I just say it. If he wins that belt, if I ever hear him saying I want to unify, <laughs> I'm going to go mad. I'm going to go mad. <laughs> you want to unify with this belt that just got made? This is... It would be worse than when Chris Eubank Jr. was running around with the IBO belt. You remember when he was taking pictures with the belt in the rave? <laughs> 
Hey, chill out. The IBO. <laughs> Chill out, man. I like Pearl? I like you, no, I like you, Junior. Yeah, chill out. I like you, yeah. Junior. But the IBO belt is it's still leave, not that belt. But at the same at time, it's it's actually becoming it's that belt. belt. It's becoming that belt. It's becoming. Sl- By the, so you're not putting no respect on the WC Pearl belt. No. <laughs> WBC Pearl champion of the. No. Get that out of here. That's disgusting. But then they're gonna make a diamond belt though, and I, I like that belt. I yeah, but the like diamond belt diamond is not it's not new like that. Okay. I don't know. I don't nah. know. Nah. That's what I'm saying. I'm they're, making a, they're fully making a diamond belt. like. But I just want to see if if they make the, the diamond belt is for Fury and Dillian White to fight. Yeah. I want to see that fight. So I, because of that, I'm happy to support that belt. But you don't, because we don't know this guy that he's fighting in India for the nah, power belt. He's just, pointless. he's going to win. And it's going to be by KO. A, I think Wilson is taking the liberties. Anyhow, this guy beats him though. What do we do with Amir Khan? Wait, all right. We if wake he loses up, for the pearl belt. We wake up and he lost the pearl belt. I love how you say we wake up because you know for sure we ain't staying up for that fight. <laughs> <laughs> I'm never staying up for a Amir Khan fight. We done that's our yeah, last night. That was that was so look demoralizing. What to us. Yeah, that was. I'm place. never staying. I never up forget for your reaction. Again. I was like, look at that. Look at that. <laughs> I was mad. Nah, he's losing. He's definitely losing. Yeah, 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 yeah. So no, but if he lost that, how do we like? We just make the make the Kell Brook fight and let them both piss off. Yeah, yeah. Because yeah, cool. I still would watch it. As much as people talk about, it, I still would watch it. So well, like, I can't even pretend. So like, obviously, more domestic stuff with Craig Richards and Andre Sterling. Hey, well, my this guy, video, Craig. Hey, them men got face to face outside the Peacock Gym, yeah. And this is you could see Mandem coming through. Fam, it, it was is. a Mandem argument. Yeah, 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 yeah. Like, yeah. if you didn't know they were boxing, you yeah. just think it's just road guys. You think it's the how, roads? How mad is it? So I want to know who came to whose gym because I know Craig. Does Craig Craig Richard chains trains there, doesn't he? Yeah. Or is it that? Wait, was that so if it's that in Croydon, is that? What's nah, that, that one is in East, like near my. I think my he's end. gone to Andre. I think he's gone to Andre's. He's gone because doesn't Craig Richard train in the same gym as um Dillian? I don't know, dude. They would have, they could have bare gyms that they yeah, train they, in. But I know but he trains with Dillian. I know that for sure. Anthony Yard trains at the Peacock gym. But they're outside the gym and they're just cussing each other. They're going at it saying, bruv, you're not, you're not ready. You're, you're not, ready. not ready. You're not ready. I mean, <laughs> <laughs> like, I like how much they said that you're not, because on Friday, someone wouldn't have been ready. What? Someone's going to lose. Because the thing is, so this, whoever loses. This fight is going to happen before this episode comes out. Yeah. So I, so right now, you lot will know who wasn't ready. Who wasn't ready? <laughs> right now, you're gonna know. Cause I'm so, going with I'm going with Craig Richards. No, the way he said you're not ready, mm, I he must him. be ready. I, I know. He, I know that. I he must be ready to tell someone that he isn't ready. And he's mad taller than him as well. He's like a foot. Bro, the like guy was difference. looking up. It was. It's it like was a the, big bro and little bro. Yeah. I thought like he's. I thought he was arguing about fighting his brother. You know, like when you're talking about yeah. if my big brother comes, you know, yeah, what yeah, 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 yeah. That's how I felt like I know. what he was doing. That's with your my opponent. Life. But that's his opponent. And I so, don't want to disrespect Andre Sterling because I've never 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 seen any of his fight highlights. No, and so I'm, I'm not, a, I can't, you know, I'm gonna keep but it. But I have seen Craig Richards. Craig Richards is my friend in it. So Okay, but I've seen Craig Richards and I just can't see Craig Richards losing to him. Yeah. And he because he guy. brought him up, he's like, because I think Craig Richards lost to Buglioni or something like that. He um it was like the, it? it said five days notice. Yeah, yeah, five days notice is a late fight. Um mm. he got thrown in, thrown in the deep end. And usually I think they was trying to Eddie was trying to see if he could just swim it. Do you know what I mean? And it didn't go the way it was meant to go. But he is a good fighter. Oh, he's yeah. a good fighter, amazing. Like I'm I'm in that I'm, You're in that camp. Yeah, I'm in that camp in it. All right, so cool. it is what it is. Support that. Yeah. Um <laughs> So we're gonna bring up the most deleted man in boxing because it's important. Do it, AB, Adrian Broder. It's the can, man. <laughs> Cause anybody can get it. African American guys a donut, bro. And the maddest thing is, yeah, the potential that this guy had in the beginning, amazing. It was potential. endless, bro. I'm, really, I'm not even gonna lie. I saw the first highlight here. There's a video online that's done like millions of views. And it's yeah. an AB highlight video. Yeah. It's like, all I do is win. And it's yeah. got, all I do is win. And it's just got that tune and it's got his highlights. The dude yeah. looks amazing. Amazing. From that moment on, it's been trash ever since. <laughs> do you know what's really sad? I know, I think I've said this on the podcast before, but if I haven't, it's here now. I see Jawante Tank Davis having a, a very similar career of 
so much, such a great prospect, having all the tools and all the glitz and glamour. He's got the voice. He he knows what to say. He knows how to build something, but he's just I, in that the inactivity. I disagree. It's I seriously I see him. The inactivity being, is a big problem. It's a big problem because it'll catch up with you. You it, can't. Oh, yeah, you yeah, can't yeah, it yeah, will yeah. catch up with you, and it's like A B is supposed to be amazing. No, but A B is Davis. supposed to be and Javante Davis. When I first saw that fight, I was like, "Oh my god, this is it." That's how I, I saw him, and I was like, "This, I, this is the next Floyd." That's how I felt. I Thing felt is, like and I this has to be it. I didn't get the next Floyd vibes. I got that more with Adrian Broner, his mannerisms, yeah. his cockiness, the flamboyance. That made me think Floyd. Javante Davis, not so much. I just more think he's just a really dominant boxer in his weight class. Mm. Do you know what I'm saying? I want to see him with Lomachenko. I want to see him fight just consistently. I mm. want to see two to, two to, two to, at least three fights a year. Uh, I want to see three, at least minimum. Especially, you know what I'm yeah, saying? Yeah. Knocking man out. I like to see him fight Tevin, down. Tevin Farmer. Great. Tevin great Farmer's fight. a great defensive great fighter. Great fight. I think it's a good a good mix just to see how he overcomes that because if he's able to undo the kind of the lock that he is yeah. that's when I'm like yo he's, this is the yeah truth. he's there because Tevin Farmer is a really good defensive fighter now with Lomachenko that would just I mean that that's if he beats Lomachenko I'm crown you. him like pound for pound number one I'm, listen I'm telling you but it's not gonna we're, as we're saying it's the same with AB and what you're hoping for AB I'm telling you Tank Right now, can you see any of those fights? What you just said just now, can you see those fights coming? Mm, no. Potentially with the Farmer fight, because they've been chatting to each other a lot on social media, but... It's, it's not coming, man. Yeah, but the Lomachenko is... It's not is, coming. That's, it's that's not coming. Away. That stuff's not coming. They're going to wait for Lomachenko to get old before that fight gets Yeah, made. it's trash. I'm not interested. Yeah. So it's like... But anyway, um, say that to say this. AB, I think AB... Do you, do you owe 50 money as well? Do you have any checks? 50. <laughs> Everyone owes but 50 AB, money. AB, fam. like, just to make sure. Just make sure you know. But AB, 50 said to him, like, he, he, 50 blocked him, in it. He said, you need to throw more punches, fam. And yo, send me some money as well. <laughs> I was just like, yo, 50 is the industry bully, fam. <laughs> but you know what? Speaking about the industry, yeah, I feel yeah. like we could we could do like some industry celebrity matchups to see how it's the how fights would end. go. I, 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 it'll be a good end. You know what I'm saying? I feel end. like we could do some matchups. Like, because I was thinking, you pick, like, let's go music, yeah? Yeah. Music artists. Yep. You pick whoever you want to pick. I got a guy in my so head. So you're going to pick someone from the industry. Yeah. And I'm going to pick someone from the industry. Yeah. Yeah. And we're going to imagine with how the scrap why, will go. How the scrap will go. Cool. So who you getting? I'm going with Getz. <laughs> Do you know who I'm going with? Go on. You, you're rude. Go on. Shug Knight. Nah, bro. <laughs> nah, you know? nah. wait, 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 wait. I'm not even phased. I'm not even phased. All right. The reason why my fighter wins, yeah? Listen, yeah? Shug Knight. He's been in jail. Fam. He, wait, Shug Knight, yeah? So was, so was um, Getz. Go on. Ask Carlos. <laughs> no was a bad man. Ask Carlos. Where's Carlos? <laughs> Talking about... No, but Shook Knight, yeah. Listen, <laughs> bro. Shook... Where's my where's Carlos? Cause... <laughs> Did Carlos ever verify it? How so? If I guess what? Exactly. <laughs> nah, because you know, I guess it's... anyone. No, anyone I don't who... like to say. I don't like to say. If... I don't like to say that gets. I don't like to put that like gets or get like tucked in by Shook nah, Knight. No. Nah, he wouldn't, fam. Bro, my fighter is heavier. He's big. That don't mean he can scrap. Did you see Shook Knight in the rave? That's who the girl. <laughs> Anyone that can choke out someone like that. Listen, yeah. Anyone that can Gets, be having fun. Get sick, no yell, into, fam. Wait, anyone that can be having fun mid wine and say, you know what, she needs to sleep. <laughs> yeah? Tell my man That's I'm a general, daughter. he'd even second it. Come on. Hey, listen, yeah. No, no, no. No, no, no. Gets, let's talk about Gets, yeah? Yeah, let's look at it. Because you got Gets. Yeah. Jay Clark. Yeah. And then you got the recent car version of Gets. Yeah. That's three brothers in one body. <laughs> This brother's got personas that man will unleash in different rounds. What that means in a fight, different game plans. Bro. He's going to come out and blitz him like Pacquiao, then come back and start moving like Floyd fam. I don't see Suge Knight being able to scrap, scrap. Of course he can. Hands, bro. Hands. Don't. Suge Knight, when you're that big, yeah, you're used to being able to intimidate. He's the main, bro. Everyone's afraid. Even nah, me talking. Fam. Get even, scared of I'm no afraid one, for. I'm afraid for you right now talking like this, bro. <laughs> Shook Knight, yeah, bro. Gets followers man on Twitter. He got my back, <laughs> bro. Shook, this is a message to you, fam. He's in jail. He's in jail. Still active, fam, bro. You're gonna see Shook get scared straight. 
I'm telling you. No, if, this... I, if I ever see... I'm running. I'm, I'm I running. Bro, have you ever seen a man that's knocked a guy over, yeah, and then went back over him <laughs> and just drove off like it was nothing? Fam. That would drill. That don't <laughs> let me know he can fight. I'm telling you, he's got nothing. These are the fighters. Let me tell you something. Eye. He's let me got talk. more let's than talk. the tiger. Right, so let's talk, Gee, yeah? Suge Knight could find the tiger and kill it. Let me tell you something, yeah? On Good. the video for the undefeated Instagram now, yeah? yeah? There's a video of Snoop Dogg hit, working out with someone right now. This Don cannot punch anything decent to save his life. Mm-hmm. He's from that era. Snoop is considered our OG. Yeah. These men don't have hands. Yeah. <laughs> So stop telling me about what Shrek Knight is capable of. Until you've seen him have hands, he don't have hands. I don't know. Because uh, until seeing that video, I would have thought, yeah, now Snoop, you know what I'm saying? Don't himself. get twisted because... Don't, Fam, Mel don't get on some. Don't get twisted. <laughs> Whack 100 beat up Mike Tyson. No, he didn't beat up Mike Tyson. <laughs> Shut that down. You best watch out. Mike Tyson not coming here and mash your ass up. Hey, Mike, I'm KG, sorry. I'm coming <laughs> for you. <laughs> no, 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 Mike. <laughs> Listen, gets bangs up, Shug Knight. Never. Never. I tell gets you. Gets bangs up, Shug Knight. I, I, comment section, stops just him. the jokes. Stops comment, him. He stops, stops him. Section, just he the stops him in the second round. So remember, I'm going to tell you what my hat guy has here. Go on. He does not care. This is what my, my guy does not care, yeah? Obviously, to be respectful, I don't want to really bring up Tupac here, yeah? but again, he does not care. <laughs> he wanted his money, didn't get it. Dr. Dre, you heard what he did to him? I've got a fighter that doesn't care with nothing to lose. I've got a fighter that'll go to a rave, dance with a girl and say, it's time to go night night. None of this means he has hands. If you know Shook, he put to sleep. You did say that, right? Huh? He put to sleep. He ain't losing, fam. Has he been put to sleep? Life for Jules doing this, bro. Oh, okay, so Shook, that's been Life put to sleep. Life for Jules doing Have this, Have you ever bro. heard that Gets got put to sleep? Where's Carlos, fam? Ask Carlos. Ask Carlos, cuz. <laughs> man was a bad man in jail. You don't just get to be a bad man in jail, bro. <laughs> Ask Carlos, because he said that with the confidence, like, no matter what, when Carlos gets here, I am vindicated bro. in this beef. Suge Knight killed Carlos. Oh, now this you're just... That's what I'm saying. Now Knight you're doing fantasy, yeah. fam. Right. <laughs> Shit, man. Produce is an idiot, man. Because I, I, my, my, my thing was working. Anyway, you lot. <laughs> yeah, we're just going to do that every now and then. Just yeah, yeah, these yeah. fantasy ones. That's Why it. not? But let us know in the comment section, just to be silly though, let us know um, who's taking that, just for jokes. But then I want to say shout out to everyone that's following us. Like the comment section is crazy. Go ahead. There's a a last um, off topic challenge for us still. It says like, has either Kev or Trav ever backed a fight just because there was girls around? (laughs) Have you ever acted up because there was girls around? Be real. No. (laughs) No. That laugh says otherwise, fam. Because I have. <laughs> yeah, sometimes you just go cinema, <laughs> innit? Sometimes if you're like... My thing is, you know when you got to back it? So if someone touches your girl's bum, yeah, you're out and that, and her friends might be there. Now it's like, you have to show them that you're not a dickhead, innit? Auntie you? is high. You know, because it's high. Like, you're there. Just imagine you're out with, your, with your, you and your missus. Yeah, but her friends are out with you. Yeah? She gets the cool bum grab. Yeah? Now, even though I know that there's bare man over there, because all of her girlfriends are here, if I don't act in the right way, I finish how they respect me. Like, I'll be coming home wanting to go out and the car's gone. <laughs> you know what I mean? The car that we share. Do you know what I'm saying? But it's her friend that's driving it. Not even my wife. My wife's upstairs. Do you know what I'm saying? All these kind of violations will start to happen to me, like, but on a regular basis, like, I'll be, like, they'll be, you, they won't respect me the same. So I have to hype it just to show, even if I know I'm going to lose. But I, what, I, what I tend to do in them situations, I overhype it till the man them will calm me down, like the ones that I was in, upset with. They'll be like, bro, I'm sorry, fam. Da, 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 da. And then do you know how that looks in the way home in the car ride? Oh, They're all like, nah, I like your man, you know, he's not having it. <laughs> Nah, I, seriously, he loves you now. I hear that. I hear do you that. know what I'm saying? What happens if I didn't do that? Yeah, she's going to start shouting at you in the street. This it's is what I'm it. saying. Numbers are getting passed out. So have you not done that though? No, nah, I've had a situation. So I'm driving, yeah? Yeah. I'm driving with my girl and it's like some Don's cut. He's cut man up, but he's he's also giving man the eye contact as well. Yeah. Oh, I've gone mad. I've gone after him. I'm thinking, nah, this... Are you mad, bro? Like, so I've caught up with him, man. I'm, 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 I'm cussing, man. Like, are you mad, bro? You're trying to cut man. And then what? Looking at man as well. Why is mm-hmm. he watching, though? 
get over there, get close. As I get closer, I'm seeing there's there's four heads in the car. <laughs> and, I'm, and I'm seeing little woolly hats and it's, it's mad dark. <laughs> so as we're getting close to the car now, <laughs> I'm speeding up, but I'm slowing down the car, but trying to make it seem like I'm still trying to catch. <laughs> because, bruv, the sight of this car was just like, nah, if I start hyping, I know this is this is going to go zero to ten. So I pulled up, fam, I slowed down the car a little bit. <laughs> took off and I was just in the car like it's not even worth it <laughs> <laughs> but the whole time man's driving though I'm keeping the anger in the car like nah man don't get violated like this <laughs> nah I did not want that smoke be real, be real yeah be real let's for all the man them in here yeah Obs is here yeah Prejules is here um raw sugar camera Kev's not here yeah um you know what can I shout out camera Kev yeah. I'm going to shout him out. Cameron Kev's been like here for like, what, 10, ep- 10 eps, helped us with the intro and that, you know what I mean? And we want to say big up to him. Nah, for Obviously, real. he's gone his own way and that, but ratings to, ratings to Cameron Kev. Nah, for Usually he'll come in with a, with a point right now, but mm-hmm. here's what it is, isn't it? Yeah? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, I want to ask a serious question though. Go true. This is for all the men then. Let's be real. You're out with your missus, yeah? You're walking down the road. Mike Tyson... In his prime. Prime t- okay. <laughs> Pre-jail, post-jail? Just got out. Pre-jail, oh, okay. J- wait, no. Pre-jail is, is prime Tyson. Court, no, court case. Court case Tyson. Court case Tyson. <laughs> With the handcuffs underneath the seat. <laughs> no, you, this, 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 no man. that Tyson. That Tyson. <laughs> but he's free. Yeah? Okay. <laughs> You're out with your missus. He comes up to her and literally, you see how I'm holding this boxing glove? Grabs her bum like this. Yeah? And looks at you. What are you lot doing? You have to say to your missus, did that, did that hurt though? <laughs> but, <laughs> is, is, it, is it proper hurting? Because I can carry you to the car. It's not even... It's a fun grab. Just... Nah. Do you know what? Do you know what is it? Wait, 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 wait. <laughs> nah, do you know what? I'll be real. I'll let be real. The I'm talking... <laughs> nah, let me, uh, let me be real though. Let me be real. Let me be real. I'll be honest, yeah? Those Any situations, lying, I'm, I'm nah, mad. those good, situations, good, good. yeah. I don't know how you just. I don't know how to leave that alone. Yeah. Like on, on a real one, I don't know how you leave that alone. Like that's your woman. Man's done that proper violation. Yeah. Yeah, he's giving her. The yeah, that's blitz. what I'm saying. The, the butt cheek is in his hand. <laughs> I don't know how to leave that yeah, alone. Ask for juice. Ask for juice. For juice. What are you saying? <laughs> Remember Tyson means like this. <laughs> <laughs> the visual of that up close is nuts. This huge man bobbing and weaving like a middleweight. No. <laughs> and you know he, he ain't even gonna duck and weave for you. You're just like Eddie Renner. He's coming straight. <laughs> you, who are you gonna phone? And what are you gonna tell them? Are you gonna tell them that Tyson is here? Ella. <laughs> Go on, go on, go on. Obviously, you still got my girl's bum in it. Yeah. <laughs> Hello. Yo, what are you saying, fam? Hey, listen. Mm. Hey, come now. Wait, what's, what's going on? Hey, listen. I'm not lying to you. Tyson's holding my girl's bum right now, cuz. Which Tyson? <laughs> Fury. <laughs> no, Mike. Mike Tyson Prime. Before court. <laughs> Hello? You have to phone the police. Phone the police, big man, because <laughs> no, no. They, got, they, got, they got more men than I could ever be. Yeah, I'm mad I'd be at you for phoning me with that type of crap. Nah, don't put that on me. Ruin my day like that. Mess it. Before, before jail. Tyson before jail. This is before even the face that is. And he's got that one part in. You know the part on top? And you just look at this part and move. In mad. Nah, I'm not interested in that, fam. Rude, what are you saying? Rude, what are you saying? I can't even go. We did. What are you saying, fam? Ah, oh, he sounded like he's gonna try and fight him. Nah, no, nah, but honestly, though, that's what that's 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 where I am, though. You're not sick. No, nah, for real, bro. Like you grabbed my girl. <laughs> no, he's he's let, he's gonna let go. I'm like twenty seconds grab. What's up? One. But, but I got to and watch the fingers. <laughs> Three. I gotta pry the fingers off my cheeks. Get off my cheeks. You know you ain't winning. You know you ain't winning. So it's either you accept that you're a dickhead and you, you 
<laughs> don't say nothing. You ask your missus, did it hurt? And you walk off, you walk the door. <laughs> or, or you run your mouth, you ask him, Mike, Mike, why are you doing that? Uh, and he's like, Yeah, you get knocked out. <laughs> There's nothing to. What are you gonna do? Bro, there you go. Do you know what I'm doing? What? I see Tyson. You're the greatest champion in the world. Nah, bro. I'm not. Divorced. Divorced. Nah, I'm not so, doing that, fam. What am I doing to Tyson? Fam, the cheeks are in his hand, fam. It's spilling over in between his fingers. That's how tight he's holding. Fam. And you're telling me you're just gonna stand there and be like, you're the greatest champion. Nah, fam. You gotta do something. Divorce. You getting a divorce? I'm getting a divorce. Nah, bro. I'm gonna be like, nah. You know what? What am I going to do then? Bang him. <laughs> Bang him. <laughs> what? I don't care, man. That's my girl. Are you mad? Bang him. You man are chatting Whilst the hand is on his cheek, this you means... man are bro, chatting shit. Listen to bro. what I'm saying. Whilst the hand is on the cheek, that's one helicopter block with... Boom! <laughs> and, then, and then you step back in the listen, hole. That's enough. My favourite rap group in the world is D-Block here. Yeah? <laughs> oh, shit. Eve got oh, no, moved nice. to by Mike Tyson. Yeah? She Gluch, Jada Kiss, <laughs> and Styles P like, didn't SP. know what to do. <laughs> <laughs> they didn't know what to do. Who am I? <laughs> Me. But you're bigger than them, though. The Silverback Gorilla, She Gluch. <laughs> Can't go to sleep, man. Listen, you lot. I don't know. Everyone's I'm got sorry, man. powers. Nah. Me, I'm, I'm, not saying, I'm not saying I'm going to win. I, I love you. No, I'm, I'm saying, not saying I'm going to win. I'm saying I'm banging him. No, nah, I'm going to be mad talks about that. Bookie shouldn't have that. <laughs> <laughs> but what did your cheeks do to Tyson? Nah, I'm sorry, man. I'm being something. I know. Anyway. It'd be a dumb decision. It'd be a dumb decision, yeah? But I'm, I'm throwing a bang for him. There's no way to win. There's no, no way. Yeah, there's no way. keep it moving, fam. Or oh, I pretend I didn't see it. I'm doing that one. I'm going to try that one. That's my first technique. I didn't see it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I have to put the cover in there. Might have to be sad. Pretend you did. Phone the man name. Yeah, yeah. None of the man name. You ain't got a man name that's good enough for that. No one you know is good enough for that. Yeah. I ain't coming. I get like, where are you? <laughs> I'll be on that one. I'd, what? I'd say where are you? I'm, babys- I'm babysitting. I can't leave. <laughs> yeah, I'm saying this, man. <laughs> man, roll up to the beef like that. <laughs> he be signing the all, but I still hold your girl's cheek out. Hey, where is it? This is nuts. <laughs> no, no, no. Okay, cool. Let's end, man. Let's yeah, end. we out. We hey, out. you look. This is undefeated. Um, subscribe, like, share, and post. Like that helps us. Like, yeah, really, for truly. Real. Like, for people real. keep saying, right, it's a dope podcast, and more people should listen. If you lot share it, it'll help it. So yeah, like some people are commenting saying, right, you lot need more subs. Tell your friends then. <laughs> tell your friends. <laughs> tell your family. Tell everyone that you know that loves boxing. What we're doing and yeah. and yeah man let's let's help this thing grow. But seriously, thank you to everyone that's watching. Big up yourselves. Peace. Have a nice one. Big up.